guys, welcome back to another shopping haul. This is a monthly shop, again, and it's a little bit different this month. I have my twin sisters staying with me, they've just arrived today and they're here for a week and one of them's a vegetarian, so there's quite a lot of vegetarian product. And I'm doing a little boofy on Sunday night for Wrestlemania for me, my brother, sisters and the kids. It's just a little boofy and it will be off plan, so if you don't want to see any non-slim and world friendly items in this shop, stop watching now because there is quite a few. Anyway, let's go and see what I got. So as per usual, I'm going to start off with the frozen items so I can get these put away quickly before they defrost. I got four bags of the frozen 5% beef mince. This was on offer. It was down to 2.75, I think. So that's quite a good price for the 5% stuff. And it's 500 grams in a pack, so really love that price. <laughs> I got five bags of the frozen chicken breast fillet portions. A bag of chicken nuggets for Ali. I got some meat-free burgers. These are for Elizabeth and me to have one night when the others have beef burgers. I checked online and these are sin-free, so I'm looking forward to trying them. Some broccoli florets. Some mini corn on the cobs. A bag of frozen mixed vegetables and they've got red pepper in there as well. A bag of peas, a bag of sliced red onion and a bag of sliced mixed peppers. I've got a bag of corn mince for Elizabeth. The crispy nuggets, these are for me and Elizabeth because I like these. These are only half a cent each. Some vegetarian bacon slices for Elizabeth. Two of these cheese and broccoli escallops. Escalopes? Escallops? I never know how to pronounce that. For Elizabeth. My standard vegetarian red onion and rosemary sausages. For me. And Elizabeth if she wants them. And two of the corn crispy fillets. I'm going on into some buffy things now. So look away if you're on Slimming World and don't want temptation. Sausage rolls. Some corn dogs. Some mini chicken fajitas, some mini duck spring rolls, some chicken satty skewers, chicken katsu bites, some mini vegetable samosas and natural chicken bites. I'm really looking forward to trying these. I've never tried these before. For fresh items, I got one jug of the skimmed milk for me and I got two six pints, I think these are. Yeah, six pint jugs of the semi-skimmed for the kids. I've got a massive block of cheese for the kids. It's Easter holidays and I've got my sisters, like I said, so I thought I'd get that. I've got two packets of the 50% reduced fat mature cheddar cheese for me. A tub of the reduced fat butter pack spreadable. I don't really use a lot of butter anymore, but if I do have a fancy it in a baked potato or something, that's why I get the reduced fat. Two bowls of the reduced fat mozzarella and a big tub of the fat-free cottage cheese. I saw these on offer in Tesco, the Philadelphia snacks, and I'm not 100% sure about the sins, but they are 103 calories per pack, so that should be about five sins. So I thought that'll be nice as a little snack, obviously. <laughs> the camembert, this is for the buffy on Sunday night. A pack of the Laughing Cow Light cheese triangles with the blue cheese and a tub of the latest Philadelphia. This is for a recipe. I'm going to do the Cajun chicken pasta one night. Some of the light dairy cheese slices and a packet of the mature cheddar cheese slices. These are just for the kids. And again, something else for the buffet. It's the reduced fat hummus. I get points for trying to be a little bit good. <laughs> I got one of these deep filled garlic flatbreads. I think this was a pound on offer at Tesco, so I just picked one of them up. We're having chili one night and possibly bolognese another night, so I got that for the kids to have with their dinner. These are for Elizabeth for the buffet, some corn cocktail sausages. And I got two packets of the pork cocktail sausages for everybody else. I'm in shrouded for the kids one night. A four pack of the beef burgers and two of these little tubs of Brussels patty. They're just for like the Easter holidays for the kids to have something on toast for supper or breakfast or lunch or whatever. I got four packets of the smoked back bacon rashers. We're having a brunch on Sunday with our grandparents so there's a couple of packets for that and a couple of packets just to stick in the freezer for the rest of the month. 
And these are for the Sunday brunch, some skinless sausages. On to fruit and veg now. I've got a packet of the tomatoes on the vine. These are for the Sunday brunch because my granny loves tomatoes. And these are just for salads and things like that. I've got a packet of these finest sugar drop tomatoes. They're really nice. I also got a garlic that I see there before I forget it because I usually forget to say I've got garlic. I got two packets of the Red Mere Farms white potatoes and three packets of the jacket potatoes. We're going to have jacket potatoes tomorrow night or Sunday night, I think. Two packets of the brown onions. I usually do get the Red Mere Farms one from Tesco, but the onions are ridiculously tiny now. They're getting smaller and smaller every time I buy them. So I've got these ones because I like the big chunky onions. A little bag of courgettes. A cucumber hide in there and a packet of peppers. I've got two bags of the carrots and a bag of iceberg lettuce. I'm so lazy, it's already shredded and ready to eat and everything. Two bunches of bananas <laughs> that look completely different, but at least we'll get this one eaten before it's time to eat this one. But they were only 69p, so I've got two bags of them. A big tray of strawberries for the Sunday brunch, except... <laughs> I forgot that my little sisters are allergic to strawberries, so I just need to make sure that they're kept away from all the rest of the food that they're going to touch. Two punnets of the red seedless grapes, one for the Sunday brunch and one just for eating whenever. And I also got some of these passion fruits. I saw them in Tesco, I think they were only £1 something, so I'll get them to try them. I've never actually tried proper passion fruit. I've always had passion fruit flavoured items and my favourite alcoholic drink is a porn star martini. So I thought I'd get the passion fruits and actually try them and see if I actually like the fruit itself, not just the flavour. Oh, you know when you do an online shop and you actually forget how much you've bought? I have so much store cupboard items. So I got 10 boxes of cereal. Um, these Tesco ones are Three for three pounds, so I've got nine of them and I've got a big box of the, well, the cheap wheat of bits. I've got um, Frosted Flakes, Choco Hoops, Honey Hoops, Strawberry Milkshake Maltese, two boxes of the Choco Nut Pillows and two boxes of the Choco Snaps. And they'll last Ali for the whole month as well as the girls for the next week. And I got the kids some biscuits. I got them these uh, digestive bars and the caramel digestive bars. And I got two packets of the Oreos. These were all on offer in Tesco's for like, I think these were 72p and these were 50p or something. So I got them the birthday party Oreos and the choco brownie Oreos. I also got a 10 pack of eggs. I got a bottle of the Mango Zero to try. And I also got four packs of these Tesco fizzy drinks as well. They're all no added sugar so I've got cream soda, orange and lemon and lime and they're for me to try. I will double check that they're all sin free before I have them but they should be because they're all zero sugar. And for Ali I got a bottle of the high juice, the orange mango and passion fruit and a bottle of the apple and mango and they were two for 2 50 I also got two boxes of the orange juice, the fresh orange juice, they're for the Sunday brunch. And a box of decaffeinated tea bags. I'm drinking decaffeinated tea at night time instead of coffee or just regular tea because I'm finding I'm having trouble sleeping sometimes and I think it's because of the, all the caffeine that I drink. I actually don't even know where to start with all this lot. Let's start here. A bottle of the table salt, a little bottle of olive oil. This is just for the camembert. I got two bottles of the lighter than light mayo. I got two bottles because I have full fat in the cupboard and the lighter than light. And Ali's just pulling out the lighter than light and using that, not even thinking or not even realising that it's a different one. So I got two bottles, so we're both on the lighter than light mayo now. And I got some of the reduced sugar and salt barbecue sauce. I'm not sure of the sins of that. I'm not a big barbecue sauce person really, but... I thought I'd get the reduced sugar and salt if I wanted to use it because that'll be better for me than the regular barbecue sauce. I got a little box of the reduced salt oxo cubes and some Cajun seasoning for the Cajun pasta that I'm making. I'm so excited about this. I actually love Nando's. Fun fact, Nando's was actually my last supper the night before I started Slimming World. 
Yeah, so I found this on the Tesco website. It was the Nando's Peri Peri Salt, which I love on the, their chips. So I thought that would be really good on my chips. And I checked it on the app and it was half a sin for two tablespoons. I got a jar of baby beetroot because I'm really loving beetroot at the minute. And so is Ali. This will probably be gone by this time next week. And some chicken stock pots. These were a pound. To go with my Piri Piri Nando seasoning, I found these, lemon and herb. Lemon and herb is actually what I get when I go to Nando's. So we're going to have this for dinner tonight with the girls. Well, Elizabeth won't. She's got something else, crispy chicken or something. When I checked it up, I think these were like four and a half cents for the bag. And I won't use the whole bag all to myself. It'll be divided up. So, and I got two of them. And I also got two of the paprika slow tender chicken, a big favourite in this household. So for just to keep in the cupboard for lunches or something like that during the Easter holidays, I got two tins of the spaghetti rings and sausages, two tins of just regular spaghetti rings, two tins of beef ravioli and two tins of macaroni cheese. I got 20 tins of sardines for the dogs, they are obsessed with sardines got four packs of the curry flavoured noodles and two packs of the chicken ones again just for quick and easy lunches for the kids a four pack of tuna chunks three tins of the sweet corn i got two tins of cannellini beans and two tins of red kidney beans and these are for the chilli that i'm going to be making i got four tins of chopped tomato two four packs of baked beans and four cartons of the tomato passata. I've got a big two kilo pack of the Easy Cook long grain rice and a big two kilo pack of sugar. I've got some of these part baked baguettes for to have with the camembert on Sunday night. And I've got a packet of these mini wraps. We're gonna have taco bowls again one night this month. So I've got them. They were only 49p or something in Tesco. I thought that was such a good deal. I've got a little pack of the mini pastries for the Sunday brunch and two packets of the pancakes for the kids. I can make pancakes, but I'm not gonna because I'm already gonna be cooking scrambled eggs, bacon, sausages, mushrooms and tomatoes. So I thought I'll just buy the ready-made ones. Got six pack of wholemeal rolls for me to have throughout the month whenever I fancy it. I've got two six packs of the white rolls for the kids, two loaves of white bread and two loaves of my King's Mill Crust wholemeal bread. Right, last few items now, just uh, some of the, I want to say toiletries, sundries or something like that. Like I said last month, we were actually stacked for a lot of toiletries, although I do feel like I should have got a Sanex for Ali, but I'll pop in and get that sometime. <laughs> But everything else were stacked up for even laundry detergent and a fairy washing up liquids and everything. We've got loads of, so I didn't need to buy anything like that. I did get the dogs some treats. I got them some bonios, some of the baker sizzlers, the dentist sticks and these whirlers. And I got two packets of the nine pack of toilet tissue, a bottle of Windeline, a toothpaste. And some kitchen towels. That was literally all I got that I needed that wasn't food items. Non-food items, that's what they're called. <laughs> My brain has disengaged. So that was everything I got. Thank you so much for watching guys. See you later. Bye.